Essential oils are a natural and enjoyable way to reduce depression. Being in a beautiful garden, smelling flowers can seem really simple, but maybe you can recall a time where doing just that really brought you a moment of peace. Because essential oils carry the scent of the plant, using them at home can bring you back to times in your life where you felt happy and at ease. Hi, I'm Andrea Bouget, founder of Aroma Head Institute, and I am really happy you're here because essential oils can definitely help with depression. It's all about scent and aroma and how much that can impact our emotional world. So there's a few approaches we can take. Usually on my YouTube channel, I teach people specific blends, but I wanted to do something special today and show you a range of possible options for how you might use the oils, depending on what works best for your lifestyle and what aromas you love. So I have three ways of using the oils for reducing depression. One is a diffuser. There's lots of kinds of electric diffusers. This is one you put water and essential oil in, you plug it in and you can run it for as long as you like. I usually run it for 15 or 20 minutes, but that's a really nice approach to creating an environment in the air, an aroma in your home that will help you feel better. And so that's one possibility. Another possibility are these great inhalers. Oops, there's the cotton that goes in the inhaler. And these inhalers are wonderful because you make the blend in the inhaler. And by the way, I have lots of videos on this YouTube channel, on the Aroma Head channel, to teach you how to make blends for inhalers or for diffusers if you want a specific recipe. So with these inhalers, you can just smell the blend you made and it has an immediate emotional impact and you can carry these with you wherever you are so that's one of my favorite things about them because you can literally put them in your pocket or a bag or backpack a purse and you can have them with you at work when you're out and about that way if you start feeling that sensation that familiar sensation of feeling depressed pull it out and use it as many times a day as you like a third way is in a cream that you can actually apply to your skin. So this is a two ounce jar where I just put unscented cream in it. And you would just drop your drops of essential oil in the cream. I use these really nice glass stirring rods and just stir it up. And again, I have recipes on this channel to show you how many drops to use. So those are three methods of application, three ways of using the diffusers, you can apply it in the air, you can, you can inhale it, you can apply it to your skin. Now let's talk specifically about some essential oils that I think might be really helpful. First we have that feeling of being uplifted. So if you're feeling depressed, if you're feeling down, and you just need to have that uplifted feeling, then, oh my gosh, we have bergamot and orange. And those two oils are so emotionally uplifting. Just smelling it, literally, just opening the bottle of bergamot and smelling it, just I can feel the nourishment go right through me. So aroma alone, right out of the bottle, is great. And then you can play with these applications. So bergamot and orange for uplifting. And then we've got frankincense and lavender. And those oils help you feel more centered. So that's, for example, you're feeling scattered, you're just feeling like a lot of things are happening at once, not quite sure how to handle it all. Maybe that feels depressing. Um, and you need to feel centered. You need to feel in yourself. Well, frankincense and lavender are gonna become quick best friends for you, okay? And then the last group of two oils that I like to use for grounding are patchouli and vetiver. And the reason I talk about grounding with depression is that if you're feeling like you're just not settled in your life, that there's a lot going on and you need to feel like you're on the ground, that feeling that you can get sometimes if you're in nature, if you're walking in the forest and you just feel connected to yourself and on the ground, these are great oils for that. So just depending on what aromas you love, if you love patchouli, fantastic. Vetiver, these are base oils. They're, they've got a deep earthy note and they really connect you to yourself. So those are some options for you. And I would be curious if you try any of these 
and you feel like it really made a difference for you, if you would come back to this video and comment below, I love reading your comments. I answer every single comment and question that comes on my YouTube channel, and it's really fun for me to know what your experiences are. So please feel free to do that. And also, if you want to learn more about orange, about frankincense, about lavender, I actually created these classes at Aromahead. They're webinar classes, and they're called Essential Oil Spotlights. And they feature the oil, one of those oils, and I have beautiful photographs and lots of in-depth information, and I think you'll love them. They're very easy to use, very user-friendly online classroom, and I teach you all kinds of blends, and I also include always five, six, seven other oils so that you get a nice rounded education. So if you're interested, I'll put the link below. Check out the Spotlight classes at Aromahead, and I hope that you have a very uplifted and enjoyable day. All right, bye for now.